Hi everyone, I am back and this is theme Thursday video and you are seeing uh, part of this little little Mr. Man here that I have to show you all. Uh, I'm not going to show him just yet because uh, he is kind of a surprise and I've been kind of keeping him a secret from people for over a year <laughs> and honestly I haven't um, really played with him until now he was a baby I had painted by an artist that um, that I found um, a, a year or so ago or more well it's been definitely a year because I had this kit for a year and uh, you know I just procrastinated I guess um, and never put him together and I finally put him together just recently so I am very much enjoying him but he's going to participate in theme Thursday this week but before I get to that um, I have some happy mail I got some looks like Christmas cards from ladies from the community so I'm going to open them up and the first one I received, I believe last week, I received it a day last week. And it is from um, Davina, Want More Babies 2015. And there is the card. I love the pictures of her babies and her cute little puppy up here in the corner. And that's Davina right there. She's a very sweet uh, person. She has a, a son, a grown son, and I believe, if I'm not mistaken, I think her son is about to um, get married or is engaged or something uh, something of that nature. I think I saw it on Instagram. So, Damina, I'm, hopefully I'm right <laughs> in that. I'm not mixing you up with somebody else. But um, she made that card. Isn't that cool? She's got her babies in there and everything. And it just says, Be Joyful. Yeah, I don't think, no, it doesn't say anything on the back. It's just one of those uh, photo cards. So, yeah, thank you, Davina. I love it. I'm going to hang that. I think I'm going to hang cards on my, um, on my doorway and do it that way. So, I also got one from Myra. Myra's uh, Little Bugs right here on YouTube. And this one says, can I, am I getting it all in the frame? Have a holly jolly Christmas. It's the best time of the year. And inside it says, wishing you lots of love and happiness this holiday season. And may the year ahead be filled with joy. And then there's a little package this year. You are one of the blessings I am most grateful for. Aw, that's so sweet. Thank you. I feel the same way. <laughs> uh, so it's lovely Lizzie and family. Uh, she calls me Lizzie. Um, may your Christmas be wrapped in happiness and tied with love. All my love, Myra and family. So isn't that nice? I love that. Thank you so much. <laughs> Aw. Thank you, thank you. Okay. So yeah, as soon as um, I'm done filming this video, I will um, hang those up. I have some tape here somewhere. Yeah, here it is. Got some tape close by, and I will um, get them hung up. So now, on to baby, right? The one that I have been taunting you with. Well, I've been taunting the folks that follow me on Facebook and Instagram. I can't taunt you guys very much because, you know make a video of not showing the baby and talking about a baby. I don't know. I can't do that. I guess <laughs> maybe I'm not that creative or something. I don't know. So anyway, this little guy is wearing a really pretty, like a sweater play suit and it buttons all down the front and in the crotch area. And it's a really soft, knitted sweater with a really pretty design on it 
It's got like the, I don't know what you call that, like a diamond type pattern. But he is wearing his little Santa Claus booties. And he's got, since he's not a girl, he's got his little Christmas uh, hat on. Okay. So, if you're ready to see, I will turn him around. I'll pick him up and just turn him the right way. Oh, my boy. And introduce him to you. <laughs> so, here he is. Some of you are probably not really, uh, not really uh, maybe knowing what kit this is or anything, and some of you just automatically know because you're you know you're into kits and you know what kits are uh, based on regardless of who paints them. So for those of you that don't know, this is the Scarlet sculpt by Bonnie Brown, and he was painted by Christina B. Um, and I butcher her last name when I try to say it. But she's on Instagram. And she is the same artist that painted my twin B, which is Nicholas. Um, I had a twin A before, too, and she also painted her. But she has since gone to a new mommy. But yeah, I, I asked Christina to paint this kit for me. A while back a year ago <laughs> over a year ago <laughs> because when she sent me the painted kit she sent me the you know the head and the limbs but she also sent me a Halloween outfit with him so that's how I know it's been over a year ago because I got a Halloween outfit with him and which was a surprise gift that she threw in. Um, I just paid for her services to paint the kit for me. And um, he is bald, so I will remove his little hat and show you his bald little head here. He's got the cutest little ears that stick out. And my family, including myself, is um, notorious for having ears that stick out when we're babies. So that's one of the reasons that drew me to this kit. My dad, his ears still stick out like that. So, mine did too when I was younger, and I guess as I grew older, I grew into my ears, right? They say you grow into something whenever you're younger. But yeah, this is him. He doesn't have any eyebrows either, because when I get him either painted hair or rooted hair, I want to have his eyebrows match his hair. <clears throat> but he does have rooted eyelashes, and I just chose a uh, like a dark brown for the eyelashes. So I've been thinking about how, what kind of uh, hair I want to give him. And while I think very cautiously and carefully about that, I'm going to leave him bald. So he's going to be like uh, wearing some hats. Sometimes I might just show him bald. Having a bald head doesn't affect me. Because my children, when they were little, they had, um, they had very bald heads. I mean, they were born with a head full of hair, but then when they, you know, when babies go through their little phases, um, they lost all their hair, and then they just had, like, peach fuzz on their head for the longest time. Both of my girls didn't really start growing a full head of hair until they were getting up into the age two range, somewhere in there. So, yeah, this is little, little man, and I've given him a name already. I've uh, been enjoying him. Gosh, when did I put him together? I think I put him together Sunday night. So I've been enjoying him kind of privately and showing you snips and s pieces of him, <laughs> parts of him, uh, for several days now on Instagram. Um, a couple times, actually. But yeah, he is just... Uh, kind of stolen my heart right now. He is really, really, really adorable. I love how his legs um, kind of curl up, sort of like the, the twin A and Bs do. And um, his little hands are just so pretty. <laughs> 
So he's such a cute baby. Let me see if I can get you guys a closer look. Um, I can't really zoom in, so I'll bring him to you. So there is his beautiful face. You can see. Hopefully it'll focus. I can't tell if it's focusing, so I'm hopeful that it is. And then there's like one of his hands. He's got beautiful hands. And here's his little bald fist that he has going on. <laughs> See, oh, he's so sweet. Yes, he is. I just love, love, love him to death. <laughs> Um, in fact, I was not at work yesterday, and I sat and cuddled with him pretty much all day. Um, I sat in front of the TV and watched some shows. I wasn't feeling the greatest yesterday, and I uh, stayed home for another reason, too, but I, um, I also wasn't feeling well myself, and I just held him all day, and he was super warm. Because I was holding him so for so long, he got really uh, warmed up and yeah, just had a lot of fun together, didn't we, buddy? But his name is uh, William, so um, I decided to give him a name. And it took me a while to well, not real long. I've I've had some babies where I've thought about names for two, upwards of two or three weeks, <laughs> so the fact that I got it done in under a week, that's pretty good, actually, but, um, when I saw him, I just kind of, you know, and it was weird, I saw him in a kit form, and I would come across the box that he lived in for over a year, and I would look at him, and I didn't really, it didn't really come to me, the name didn't come to me until I actually put him together, and saw the finished product and I was like William that's his name so yeah please help me welcome William and I promise ladies and gents next video I will reveal the um, the wacky whenever video that I just shot recently um, posted on when did I post that I posted it on Tuesday so yeah, um, yeah, so <laughs> I will reveal that. Um, I've gotten some folks being a little confused, and I'll explain that in the video um, to help shed some light on the confusion that some folks are having. I think some of the folks that are confused are the ones that are new, that have just joined my channel. So welcome. Um, I do make normal videos too, I promise. <laughs> but that one was one of those fun ones. So, right? Right, William? So, yeah, we're going to go and um, go see what my girlies are up to. They're both downstairs. And they're both... I don't know. I think they're raiding my fridge. Probably going to have to go grocery shopping again. I swear, teenage girls, and I'm sure teenage boys are worse... But, oh, their appetites are crazy. I have to, like, remind them, hey, girls, you know, we gotta kind of let the food um, last a little longer than a day. <laughs> so, anyway, um, oh, I wanted to show you something real quick, and then I'll go. I promise. Um, I got these cute little things today at Walmart, and they're like little Jingle Bell headbands. But they're for, for adults. And um, they have little reindeer on them. So you can put them around like a like a sweat band kind of thing. Put them around your head. And you got jiggly bells. And you turn yourself into a reindeer. Right? Look at that. That would fit across his little body, huh? So that won't fit on you, will it, buddy? Nope. But look how cute. Look how cute. <laughs> So yeah, I got a red one and a green one, and they were only like, um, I think under four dollars, but they are Velcro, and you can adjust them based on the size of your head, so, I mean, you can only adjust them 
as long as this is. Unless you add more Velcro, you ladies out there that sew can add more Velcro. And probably get it on a baby head if you really wanted to. But yeah, I thought they were so cute. And uh, Goldie needed a Christmas hat for school. And um, I just wasn't feeling the hats. And I saw these and I thought, well, this is going to have to do. And she actually loves them. So she's going to take the red one. And I think I'll wear the green one this year. I'll t wear it to work. So yeah, thank you all for watching and coming with me. Um, say hi to little William. And William those kisses to every one of you. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a baby. I have always liked this sculpt and I, I, I don't know what was wrong with me. I don't know why it took me so long to put them together. I just, I think there's just times when I just shut down and I don't feel like doing much of anything. Um, I go through periods of like that and um, I don't know. And I don't know what triggers it. I don't know if it's like if I go through a series of migraines, sometimes I do that. Um, the school, when I was in college, for sure, I would have periods where it shut down. Even whenever I had a bunch of things due, I would shut down. And it's like, you can't do that. You have to keep moving. So, it was just, ugh. <laughs> it would get crazy sometimes. So, anyway, I still find myself doing that on occasion. And uh, I end up not getting a whole lot done. Or, or I, have, I have these ambitions to do certain things and then I end up not getting there and I just think I struggle sometimes with stuff I don't know if I get overwhelmed or what happens so anyway have a wonderful theme Thursday and I hope I will see you back because I'm gonna I'm gonna um reveal the big secret from the wacky whenever video next okay guys thank you so much for watching Please like, share, and subscribe if you wish, and I'll see you all soon. Bye-bye.